All right, Tuesday, April 28th. Let's get warm. Um, if you have a partner at the house, you can do this with a partner. Um, but if you don't, just do this individually. We're gonna go every two minutes, okay? If you have a partner, you're just gonna go every minute and then switch with your partner. So I'm just gonna explain the individual. Uh, the way it goes down is every two minutes, minute zero, first thing you do is run in place. And we're gonna run in place for 30 seconds. And then you're gonna do 10 bootstrap squats, okay? So you have 30 seconds of running, 10 bootstrap squats, at, and then rest. At minute two, you're gonna run in place for 30 seconds, and you're gonna do one push-up plus two shoulder taps for eight reps. So push-up, one, two, push-up, one, two, eight total push-ups there. At minute four, you start all over again. Next movement is 30 seconds running in place, and then rotational planks. We're gonna go 10 total, five on each side, in that plank position, rotating. Then, uh, the next two minutes, 100 meter run, and then a burpee and jumping air squat, and we'll do eight reps of that. Burpee, jump, air squat, burpee, jump, air squat, eight total reps of that, okay? That'll be your warm up every two minutes on the second minute, cool? Remember that when you complete your task of 30 seconds of running, and your eight to 10 reps or whatever, you rest the remainder of the time into that two minute. If you have a partner, just have one partner start on the run, the other on the bootstrap squats, and then just switch. Cool, once you're done with that, we'll be ready for our workout prep. All right folks, movement prep. We're gonna review the single arm dumbbell sumo deadlift high pull. Pretty long name for the movement there. And then some jumping action we're gonna get in there, cool. You're gonna have a dumbbell, sumo position, high pull, sumo deadlift, to high pull. One, two, two important things we're looking for. Core to extremity movement pattern, meaning use your legs and hips first, and then at the very end, the arm. Second thing we're looking for is bar path or dumbbell path. Keep it close, right? You don't wanna swing that thing out away from you. Try to move as efficient as possible. So as you drive, keep it nice and close, right next to your rib cage here. Get that elbow high and outside. All right, let's practice 10 on each arm, uh, 20 total. Cool. Then you're gonna set up your dumbbells about three to five feet apart, more or less. Um, and you're gonna practice jumping back and forth through these. How does that look like? Keeping your arms here, kind of using the arms as momentum helps with the agility and the ability to move quickly off the toes. Cool? Let's practice six total reps, three back and forth. Okay, three and three. Then you're gonna practice just jumping with the dumbbell in your hands. Okay? You can here, one, two, three. Practice. 10 jumps there, and then we'll be ready for our workout. All right, guys, for your Metcon, we have another EMOM type of Metcon. Okay, we're gonna go five rounds. Minute one, you're gonna go 16 single arm dumbbell sumo deadlift high poles. Okay, eight on one arm, eight on the other. You can choose to do four, 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 four. You can choose to do eight and eight. Your choice there. As soon as you complete your 16 sumo deadlift high pulls, then you guys will rest. The top of the next minute, 15 object jumps or box jumps. So basically any box object you have to jump on, you got 15 repetitions there. If your object is kind of short, not like the regular 24, 20 inch box we have at the gym, and it's like super easy for you, instead of just doing 15, up it to 20, 25 reps, something's gonna take you anywhere between 30 to 45 seconds of work. Cool, and then we have the next minute, 10 burpees. Again, 10 burpees should be within that 30 second range-ish. And uh, just make sure you're counting your reps and keeping track of that. The next minute is gonna be everyone's favorite rest on minute four, and then we'll repeat the whole cycle for five rounds. Simple, straightforward, get after it. 